Hello and welcome to Wandering Wanda. I'm Ariel. Today we're going to do the hitching up of the blue ox this time. But the first thing you need to do before you do anything else is you have to make sure your stabilizers are up. So I've got electric stabilizers. So before I do anything else, this is the first thing I do. Make sure the stabilizers are up. I look underneath. To make sure. The other thing I do make sure, I have to make sure that the steps are up. If they're not up, the lower step, get you get ruined essentially okay close this up and put up the steps oh the other thing you need to make sure is that your wheels are chalked. So I use the X chalks on both sides of the tires. So make sure they're both still on and connected. You don't want your trailer accidentally rolling away. That would be very bad. When you're, when you're connecting your trailer to your truck, not a good thing. So you don't want your trailer rolling away Make sure your X, your chocks are on, and in my case, I have X chocks on both sides. All right, we've got to take out the, the chalk lock, the coupler lock. What I do is I raise up this part of the trailer hitch, I guess. I raise it up to about here. This is where the, the ball hits. So we'll raise it up. And I'll back up the truck. Now I actually have a marker in the back of the truck. Let me show you. Here's my marker, which is the center line of the truck itself. And with this marker, when I'm backing it up, I line it up to this one. This is center right here, but from the driver's side of the truck, I'm not on center. I'm off a little bit, so if I line it up to the, the mark, center marker of the back of the truck, to this particular rivet, I can generally hit the ball or come pretty close to it. So follow along.
pin, but to know when I pull this down and this thing lines up. That's it. One try. Put the lock in there. Make this really easy. You extend this almost as high as it will go without lifting the tires of the truck <laughs> off the ground. It's about good. I hook up the electrical. Chains. Sure, the chains are across. Okay, this switch is the emergency breakaway. So, for some odd reason, the trailer should come apart. It will pull this string. Set the, the brakes in the trailer off and it will lock and then it'll just stop. Hopefully it will stop. Okay, chains all set up, electrical set up. Now for the blue ox itself. This little knob, knob here, insert it in. Push this knob down. Pull this handle out. And then it is the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight. It's the eighth chain. In my case, I got some nail polish and I put nail polish around this chain so I know which one it is every single time. Pull it in. And if you got it really high up, you don't need to use this tool which came with it. This tool is terrible. There isn't enough leverage for it, and it's great for scraping the aluminum in my tank. Terrible. This is absolutely useless. So instead, I got a one inch, I don't even know what this is called. A one inch thingy like this and this is for tire changing and it fits just right in here. Okay, so always have one of these. But if you raise it up high enough, the blue ox will actually, you can do it by hand. And it will lock. Ta da! Now you do the same on the other side. Now just lower it. came with the blue ox absolutely useless. Go out and buy yourself a tire changing wrench and uh, one of these things, it's one inch, I don't know what it's called. 
but you can get this at most auto parts stores. It's a lot better than this piece of crap that came with the blue ox. That's it. Well, no, that's just not it. Now I gotta take the hex chops off, check the lighting, and make sure that the brake lights work. And how I do that is I just turn on the emergency hazards, and I walk around, do a final inspection, make sure I didn't forget anything or nothing is down. So I'm gonna do that now. And hazards are blinking. I don't know if you can see it, but they're blinking. Now, and now to take the X chalk off that I'm hooked, that I'm all hooked up. All right, did my final walkthrough around. Now we're going off to the dealer. So that was hitching up the truck using the Blue Ox stabilizer system. All right, thank you for watching. Bye.